Hello everyone, Ragamuni here. Round two, let's go. This time, you are mine! Let's get Lance out here first. Because once again, him sticking stacks of virus on him is going to be is going to be absolutely instrumental to our success. Now let's see here. And we'll go ahead and get this up for the defensive powers. Starting out very similarly. I feel like we've been here before. Oh, we're getting some bomb damage in. Kill some extra cats for the heck of it. Good. Alright. Virus stacks. Give us... What else do you have on you? That's right, and I have to actually get the curse status to get on them. So I'll go ahead and take a turn now and do exactly that. Switch you out for... Actually, switch you out, I guess. I think. Let's cast a regen. One thing that I... Okay, no legs, just dies. One thing that I really do absolutely hate about some of these bosses, in general, is that... Oh wow, that's actually that's actually a really big detriment now that I look at it. Uh, from the way I'm looking at it, is you really don't have any control over what goes on. Turns from heaven back to hell. Now, please save that skills for emergencies and no legs. I'm sure it's going to be super useful. Sure will be. I'm gonna go ahead and start sticking poison on him. Don't do that again. Yeah, he hits really hard. Okay. That's actually a blessing in disguise. I thought that no I thought that was a no legs if died for a second there. Go ahead and stick poison up. The downside of course is I have to wait three turns for my defensive buffs to come back. So they know exactly how I'm going to do this. What even? Why? You heard me right. I'm cuning. This will give everybody, even the backups, a little bit of help. I I actually do enjoy the pajama shot there of donut touch. That's kind of funny. Cats can be heard speaking demonic words. Yeah, even with full, like, even with full 80% buffs that I have access to with Anna right now, look how, look at that. And then that's back down. Thankfully, I can fix that, so I'm not worried. Alright, let's see here. Let me go ahead and stick Curse back on him. So nine turns of that ought to do nicely. Uh, let's see here. Summon. Give me hate. Let me haste no legs there. So I'm going to go ahead and fix our issue here with defense. Give him a cupcake. That'll reduce his cooldowns by two. And we can reapply our defensive buffs.
Okay. Alright, everyone here dies but no legs. I hate when they do that. Do you mind? I said, do you mind? Thank you. Go ahead and get Matt out of here. Go ahead and get her out of here. All right, let's see here. The stats are, we're in a much better state than we were. We just gotta get that health down. So I think I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and get a stagger up. That's right, you better surrender. Let me go ahead and weaken Telperion a bit more. I'm gonna go ahead and give an Encore to... Now see, I was supposed to put good luck status on Anna there first. I'd love to do that now still. I'd also like to put Evasion up and try to keep everyone alive. I think I'm gonna do that. Let's, let's play... Let's take a dance with death. I love how even with my evasion stats boosted, I'm still getting hit to Kingdom Come. That was a chance to finish me off, foe. This is something stupid. That is not something stupid! Reality hits him like a ton of bricks. Alright, this is our chance. This is our chance. Alright, coffee on you. Nice try, foes. Indeed. We'll go ahead and do this. Get us the good bad luck swing. I am now in three times. Count them three times. The catch bonus gear. You have all those statuses on you. Come here, you stupid cat nest. There we go. Revenge has been served. And look at this. It's a really good one. Nine, full nine turns of curse. If they can't resist anything. So it's really strong. So there you are. That didn't take me too long. I told you it's not the hardest fight in the world, but it can be problematic. With that cursed tree gone, the Mystic Woods should eventually return to normal. I hope. It looks like those roots could have easily reached the surface. I agree with you. This must have been the source of the curse. Cats seem to be behind all the world's problems, huh? Nothing good ever comes from cats. Meow! No legs takes offense to your remark, Lance. No Legs says, not all cats, you ought to... Well, I'll let you read the word there. Tell No Legs that I'm not going to exchange insults with an animal. I'm far above that. <laughs> Let's just get out of here. I agree. Let's see what kind of goodies we get today. The Shell Armor boosts holy damage. Peanut. The Soul Crusher. I think this is a Scythe with curse status. Nice. And the Death Mask. Kind of reminds me of the three halves is Death Knight's masks. Ooh, mushrooms. Those could have some juicy secrets. Always check the map because you never know. Typically with rooms like this, I just want to check all the scenery because that's t uh, pretty much where they go to hide their stuff. But all right, we've cleaned out this bonus dungeon. We've cleaned out. Let me look at my bestiary here, because that's typically how I. That's typically how I'm able to judge how well I'm doing and what bosses I know I've cleared, as well as sides. This is where you can see all of them. So we've done Jotuns. We've done Jotuns. We've done Soul. Page two. Done all that stuff. I have to. I have to recatch a lot of stuff that I used for forges again. I'll do that off screen. That's uh, page. two. Page three. Oh, page one. There we go. It's page four. I'm thinking of Laurelin, Talpirian. I fought the Valkyrie tank and its subordinates. I scanned that thing, right? Good. Wait. I don't think I scanned that thing. <laughs> no. I know it's here, but I don't think... I honestly think we did not scan Neon Valkyrie. 
Yeah, I don't think we scanned it. No, my 100% best dairy run. Why? Laurelin Shockwave Bomb. Yeah, we didn't scan it. Whoops. Did we encounter it earlier? Oh, well. I'm boring, you guys. Let's go. I gotta figure... Why am I going around? Alright, so I've taken care of the arcades that I know I can take care of. I think it's finally time to start, you know, making headway down towards the south. Because I have nothing left to really do. Ah, you know what just crossed my mind? I forgot to change the calendar again. I'll have to do that next part. Man, now we can actually sail off the continent here. Now this shrine that you see here, six stones that are scattered pretty much throughout, uh, across the entire bottom of the screen here. And I think we get some exposition here if we go from here. Question, can I like swim? You didn't ask before we took off. <laughs> oh snap, no legs is doomed if he falls off the raft. I don't think any of us even considered that. Ow. He's trying so hard. Um, thing here. You see the rainbow that's being cast? Well, as it turns out, there's bon there's a hidden bonus treasure when you have the stone in there. So keep that in mind. Also, let me turn this back to zero before I go any further. All right, let's see here. I would love it. I would love it if I just put my. Let me see here. Where's the bomb elemental gun? There it is. Remind me to forge that thing later. You know what I wouldn't have minded? An upgrade to those single target buff skills that give you a that give you nowhere near as much of a buff, like say, let's say you AoE targeted to give you a 40% attack buff and maybe two turns of Brave, uh, but make it AoE. Kind of a bit of a thing where you, kind of like these attacks, where you could focus on one or focus on both. You get where I'm coming from? Any of you guys get where I'm coming from? That would help. All right, you're gone. All right, I can just bomb them all. Get out of here. You're all alone, you damn wraith. Be very careful with the chill status. If you have anything that can cause wet, it will stack and it will freeze you, bypassing the wet, bypassing the chill freeze stuff that you have, which is kind of dumb. Ah, sushi. And no laser's case, that's probably good treats. Gomp, sir! Well, I don't know. Let's see. Ah, good! One death already! my poison set up on, don't I? Don't you guys absorb it? Oh, you don't! Awesome! Anna, be primary DPS again and kick their shins. You know how to kick shins, right? Oh, whatever. Just toss all the leaves at them. That was a crit. Ooh, Moon Pearl. That's great. Another good forge I can have. Some pink squids. Pretty sure these guys can't be frozen. They have a 70% resist chance. They, they can be frozen. Hmm. How will I handle this? Can I encore you? Yeah. Yeah, I can encore you.
Oh, we didn't encore you. Oops. Imagine if Hail actually damaged you like in Pokemon. That wouldn't be fun. You're like this big little sliver of health and all of a sudden, boop, dead. At least now that we get some respectable AP, we'll be able to upgrade skills again. And then it's the first stone. I want to start today by getting at least three of them. Alright, the dumb currents that they got going. Can I grab that? Uh, that would be a no. Something that's kind of annoyingly... some One of the ways that this world's very annoyingly designed, I would say, is the sheer fact that so much of it is just, you know... You can clearly see where you want to go, but it's just, there's one thing in the way at all times. Feels good to be back at sea. We're finally free to sail the open waters and go wherever we want. I've never been out sailing before, and I've heard horrible stories about giant sea monsters pulling on boats under with their lanky tentacles. By the way, how do you control this thing? There doesn't even seem to be any steering mechanism. I'm not exactly filled with confidence. <laughs> sailing the raft is just like walking. You think of moving forward and it just happens. I spent most of my childhood on a raft. My parents took me all around the world. Unfortunately, I was too young to remember most of it, so I didn't gain any experience. And also, they decided to ditch me on an island when things got too dangerous. <laughs> I had to figure out everything on my own, so maybe that's why I'm a bit slow sometimes. So, Matt, do you think your parents are still alive out there somewhere? Are they pirates, or... What? Well, uh... <laughs> they hit a ra So they hit a big wave, and now they're drowning. Uh, but I'm not optimistic. But I've accepted that long ago. I'm sure they'd be proud of you now, sailing off on your adventure with a bunch of cuties. <laughs> I hope so. Stone back there. Which I annoyingly have to walk all the way around to reach. I cannot reach that secret until much later. Alright, you have to go like inside the damn thing. And then you have to do this. Hmm. hmm. I have an idea. Call me crazy, but go get him, paper monster! Starts to understand the appeal of commanding others around. So that is an element. Looks like poison. That's right, get out of here. Dumb hermit crab. Turnip, sacred ruin. I believe by going this, yeah, by this going this way, I can get up here. A couple of extra healing items, it never hurt. I'm pretty sure one absorbs poison. Lyron, what the hell do you hit for? You hit for wind, and they're resistant to it. Okay. Right, so here's the bad breath. Here's the bad breath attack. What I don't like is that it also puts shroud on them, so you can't really keep track of everything that's there. You know? Let's see here. Weak to poison. I got your number, mate. Plus with Shroud, you can't see what they're weak to as well. Kind of sucks. I'm pretty sure I could catch him in this state. <laughs> oh, I absorb water in this build. I will just kill you off like that, I guess. Good and stuffed. Stone number two. Get something there. Now I can sail onward.
I don't even have to bother. I know you absorb it. Take this, you. Get him, Glauron! Nothing like having your own Eldritch Abomination of a Worm drawn by exactly one person. I will admit that, like, as much as that, that particular set of bosses was an absolute pain in the ass, I love the unique art style that we have there. And when I say unique, I mean more along the lines of... When's the last time you ever thought in an RPG you'd see a pencil and paper style thing to fight? That's what I mean. It gets really good. I'm a little upset I also... I'm also a little bit upset that I burned a chili pepper, but it's like, eh, might as well use them. Almost had him. I don't know, like, this is limit back. There we go. Ooh, the Lego brick. Good. I know we need that for something else, too. What was it? I thought it was that. No. Need mithril shards. Oh, I need it for that, huh? Need some dark runes. One puzzle piece and two sapphires for that meager thing. That was something I needed for. Oh, for the hellfire gun. Oh well, I'll worry about that later. We have three of the six stones, so I'll go and deliver them real quick. Alright, there's one. Give me an encore. Let's go for another. Again! <laughs> you didn't even want to bother with me. <laughs> oh, we got. I know you're hiding something. Guess not. Now let's go back to the start. Alright, you guys resist bomb at all? Yeah, you do actually. Interesting. What else you guys hate? Oh, you have no adverse reaction to poison, so... Do it again, Anna! More leaves! More leaf cuts! The leaf cuts even exist?
I said more leaf cuts. Ah, let's get Lance in here. Have some fun. Hi. All right, chill kind of, chill kind of prevents that. Huh. Oh well. Let's get a stagger going. Good. Do I have everything? Yeah, I get a triple crit from this. Interesting. I'm gonna go for it. Triple crit. Huh? No triple crit. you hiding from us. Ooh, armor. Captain's coat. This was actually Matt's starting gear back uh, in uh, EBF 3, I believe. Anyways, uh, why the hell am I here? Well, if you do this, you get a free bow. The Thor's hammer. Thunder elemental. Really nice for taking out a lot of these aquatic style enemies. I don't know why that particular arrangement is how you get it, either. Uh, let me see the time. Yeah, let's take care of this. Let's take care of the rest of the treasure on this screen, I guess. Get these guys taken care of ASAP so we can get out of here. Wow, you did nothing, Lance. All right, let's forge that bow. Uh, bows, this. Manly Thunderbolt while attacking. Randomly cast Thunderstorm. I believe that's the stun weather. Counter attacks with Aqua Arrow. All right, you need two Moon Pearls for that. This is an interesting one, though, because, as you see here, it gives you the ability to enchant with her. Kind of in the similar way that No Legs can enchant with his Book of Spells. What else? Counterattacks with normal attack and defense drop. Interesting. Nut gun. Anything else? Oh, right. Have some stuff to forge there. There's that. Defending gives enchanted status. So, I'm not so sure I like this one. I mean, I get that there's good applications. If you know you're going to be up against magical foes and you need to tank single target magical hits, it helps immensely with doing exactly that. It helps immensely with doing exactly that. I'll just do that. Increase the chance of linked status effects. That would help too, I guess. One burger. Oh, that's why I wanted that. That's why I wanted to do that. Pixel sunglasses. Eh, let's just give it to you. And now may I present to you one re- Oh, oh we do have roids. Go ahead and get rid of these. Okay. Yeah, get him, Glauron! I don't care anymore! Kill them all! Rawr! That did nothing. Wow, these guys have meh. These guys are very mixed. Okay, I found the secret. Spam holy.
Spam the holy arrows! I keep forgetting to change your gear back, too. Ooh, silver bar. Thank you. And for you, a few more roids. Can we just fight you? Yeah, we can. Get him, no legs! Earth and Thunder. You too? Yeah, you too. Good clearance. Uh, second verse, same as the first. Whoops, I was supposed to use the Thunder Arrow. That was perfectly balanced, if I dare say so myself. Thunder! There we go. Ooh! Bit of a lull in the action, though, just because... Oh, look what we're doing. There's that, there's that. Get a glimpse of the next area here, and I think it'll be a perfect way to cut this off. Oh, listen to this. This was the theme of that little ice cave section in... Uh, prior to version 1, when this was just in true beta. This is a beautiful track, one of Fearn's best works, if I'm being perfectly honest. Whoa, I've never seen ruins like these before. History textbooks show many temples built for the ancient deities, such as Godcat or Akron. But these are unlike any of those. The face sculptures on these ruins don't look like any gods I've ever heard of. The meteor impact has likely caused a global warming effect. Even a difference of a few degrees would have caused a huge portion of the world's ice caps to melt. A man-made global warming may be a myth, but a meteor impact could definitely do it. Is it possible these runes lay undiscovered for thousands of years, deep under the ice? Well, we might be some of the first people to ever see them. Maybe I should start taking notes. That must mean there's loot buried around here, too. Is it too much to ask for some lore and backstory behind the places we meet? You simpletons only care for your selfish desire. <laughs> uh, I like Anna's explanation the best. What if space aliens made this? <sighs> I know, Anna. They're all idiots. Let's get that treasure, and then we'll call it a day. Oh, we have this theme again. Bomb, bomb, the bomb, bomb, and more bombs. The answer is bombs. Ah, oh, really? Now oh, that's what I get for not having the. Uh, bomb skirt equipped, I guess. Ooh, more friends. Oh, you're decided a death warrant there, pal. You should have gone with the invisible status. Bomb them all, Nats! Or, uh, Anna? And I keep doing that. How many times have I done that in this LP by accidentally calling Anna? By accidentally calling Anna Natalie? I swear I've gotta be in the hundred digit. I gotta be in the triple digits by now. There we go. Whoop! Do that. And back here, we get the Ice Shards Flare. Very good flare. Or, not a flare, but a hat. That's a hat, right? Yeah, you're a hat. I thought that was a... Looked like a flare from here. Jesus. Let's forge it. I love how I say it's a flare and you Wow, I can't even... Wow. <laughs> when you know you have no material. Alright, I think this is a good stopping point for today. Wait, can I go back there? Ah... Foiled again. Anyways, we can't get into this area proper until we actually open that gate. So next time we meet, we're going to continue finding the rest of the stones. Maybe meet a few people along the way. Until then, this is Ragnarok signing out. You guys have a great night. Thanks for watching, and I will see you later. Take it easy.